Hi, my name is Adrian Roman, and I'm a student from UC Davis, double major in applied mathematics and computer science. I actually came to NYU to give an oral presentation about my research in computational neuroscience at the SMPC conference during summer 2019. There, I presented the dynamical systems model I designed in collaboration with a PhD student, Iran Roman, and Professor Edward Large from Yukon. Our goal was to simulate human data that shows how an individual's spontaneous motor tempo affects synchronization in various musical contexts. For example, the larger the difference between two synchronizing musicians' spontaneous motor tempo, the harder it is for them to synchronize. Our model uses the canonical oscillator described by Professor Large, where the oscillator has a natural frequency, behaving similar like an individual spontaneous motor tempo. Also, individuals can follow the beat of almost any music, being fast or slow. So to simulate this, our model listens to an external stimulus here represented by Big F. We added a heavy and frequency learning mechanism to allow the oscillator to adaptively synchronize to an external stimulus frequency. Here, lambda one is the learning rate, which controls how fast the oscillator learns frequency from a stimulus. Furthermore, an individual spontaneous motor tempo is unique and remains stable before and after musical performance. To mimic this behavior, we added an elasticity parameter which allows the oscillator to return to its original frequency after being stimulated. Lambda 2 here is the strength of that elasticity parameter. Ultimately, our model supports our hypothesis that nonlinear oscillators with elastic frequency learning mechanisms can explain how human spontaneous motor tempos affect, affect synchronization. From that conference where I talked to researchers and walked around campus, I knew I wanted to become part of the NYU community one day. Given my passion for applied mathematics, I chose Corent because it is an ideal place with cutting edge research in dynamical systems and mathematical biology. There are also multiple extraordinary professors I can picture myself working with. For example, I will be extremely grateful to learn from Professor Young, who has a career performing rigorous analysis of dynamical systems with applications in neuroscience. Similarly, I greatly admire Professor Rinsoff's research. I can picture myself working with him on theoretical neuroscience projects, contributing to the understanding of auditory spatial perception projects through dynamical systems approaches. Now, Current is not only a great institute for me academically, but it also appeals to me personally. My brother, who is the only family member I have in the US, will be pursuing a postdoc at NYU. And I will be very happy to be in the same city and university as him. Overall, based on my research interests and prior experiences in computational mathematics, I believe I'm a good candidate for pursuing a PhD at Corent Institute. If I'm given this opportunity, I will work hard and passionately to learn from the talented faculty and to make meaningful scientific contributions. Thank you so much.